Good morning. How are you today? I'm very happy to be alive today. I looked outside, I saw a bunch of clouds, and I said, forget you. I know there's a sun in there somewhere. Anyway, I'm having a nice morning. Uh, the coffee of the day today is Krispy Kreme Bold 1937. Don't bother with it. It's not very good. It's not very bold. Uh, the coffee mug for today is my Starbucks Epcot mug. Uh, another place that I've never been. But my roommate from after high school, uh, John Camp and dear friend, uh, has a seasonal pass to Epcot because he loves it so much. He loves eating all the foreign foods. Ironically, the other half of the year when he doesn't live in Orlando, he lives in Europe, travels Europe, and eats the real foods. Uh, I'm going to tag him here because uh, he used to have this great travel blog, and I think maybe we could um, encourage him to start writing again. All right, we're going to read. Oh, wait. Tip of the day, wash your hands. Everybody wash your hands. Now, if you need some incentive to wash your hands, watch one of the best movies of the 90s, as good as it gets. Jack Nicholson won Best Actor for this, his third Oscar. Uh, he plays a writer who washes his hands like 100 times a day. And you know what? Watch that movie from beginning to end. He doesn't get sick. Watch, wash hands. Doesn't get sick. Wash hands. Doesn't get sick. Do the math. Listen to the science. Wash your hands. All right. Now we're going to get down to the reading for today. 406. Alice Roosevelt Longworth. If you haven't got anything nice to say about anybody, come sit next to me. This is her again. 407. I'll try anything once. Uh, this is something she said after giving birth at the age of 41. <laughs> All right, 408. Two-time Oscar-winning actor Spencer Tracy says, Days off. That's all he says. But it's in response to when being asked what he looks for in a script. He looks for days off. <laughs> all right, Vincent Canby on the Academy Awards, 409. We are drawn to our television sets each April, the way we are drawn to the scene of an accident. The Oscars are like the scene of an accident. Hmm. Have things changed since Vincent Canby said this? You decide. 410, Thomas Deloney. God sends meat and the devil sends cooks. Dude, God sends meat and the devil sends cooks. That is twist in my mind in so many ways, guys. How friggin' deep. All right, I'm going to end it at that because I got to digest and I suggest you guys too. Whoa. All right, catch you tomorrow.